I want to just say, number one, there's a, this is a great city. Yeah. Uh, but at the same time, when you go through, uh, we've been dealing with this coronavirus for one year. Quite frankly, it's almost one year ago today yeah. is when things just kind of stopped in the city of Houston. So for 12 months, uh, people have been dealing with the coronavirus. And then, of course, three years, uh, three weeks ago was the winter storm. A lot of people have busted pipes, still have a, a busted pipes, leaks, uh, which has led to water insecurities and food insecurities, just tremendous needs. And to kind of put it in some sort of a uh, frame of reference, uh, Public Works estimated about 50,000 households had, had water, uh, pipes that were leaking, a, a, a burst, and then about 400 apartment complexes. And so even to this day, there are a lot of needs that exist in our city. A lot of people have fixed their homes and moved on. But at the same time, there are a lot of people who are still struggling, just, try to hang, just trying to hang on. And, uh, and so we are here at Allen Parkway Village to assist many people here, residents, many of whom are senior citizens. And quite frankly, you know, wondering, okay, where can we get help and, and how do we get help? And, and I just wanna, I just wanna thank, uh, I wanna thank the Ismaili community. I tell you, the diversity of our city really show up in our moment of crisis. And uh, the Ismaili community has been uh, right by, let me just, if I can put it in personal terms, right by my side every step of the way while I've been mayor. Uh, because it has been uh, uh, six, almost six years of crisis management. Yes. I mean, from tax day flood, Harvey, uh, the Ismaili community stepped up in a major way during Harvey, uh, food distributions, being at the George R. Brown, when we had close to 10,000 people there. They were given a thousand points of light by, by former president uh, George Bush when we were in, at Texas A&M University. So I just want to give a big thank you, a big thank you to the Ismaili community, uh, young and old, because uh, let me tell you, uh, from other sites, they recognized that, you know, seniors were coming to pick up the water, but they were having a hard time getting the water to their apartments, to where they live. And uh, so today, you know, they, you know, they got a lot of workers and they are actually helping people take their water and food to their actual units. So they've gone that extra mile, that extra step. And so give it up to this Ismaili community.